happening today. Cleanup efforts shift into high gear at the site of that massive sinkhole in Pasco County. And for the first time, we will be getting an up close look at all that devastation. News Channel 8's Paul Mueller is live in Land Lakes this morning. And Paul, you were there right moments after that earth gave way that day. And it was certainly a scary scene. Good morning, Avery. And you know what? Crews really didn't know how how big that sinkhole would become. It was growing so quickly that literally they were in a race against the clock. But now, just a couple of weeks later, well, uh, the ground is stable, so much so that we're going to be allowed to go back into that very area this morning. Now, yesterday, crews brought in heavy equipment to begin getting rid of the debris, all in preparation for today. And back when that sinkhole first opened a little more than two weeks ago, they had no idea really what they were dealing with. As I said, the hole was opening and it was happening so quickly, but eventually it swallowed up two homes, cars, and some boats. Now, we have seen the devastation from the air, but at 11 o'clock this morning, for just one hour, we'll be able to see that sinkhole on the ground closer than we've ever seen before. But right now, it's important to, to try to get a semblance of normalcy back to this neighborhood. That's going to start with cleaning this sinkhole out from the debris that's in there. Now, how long will the cleanup take? They say two to four weeks, but that could change at any time. I mean, you have a lot of variables here, like the shifting sand and, of course, Mother Nature, right? Then there's filling in that space. How much dirt will they need? Well, they say it could be equivalent to 14 Olympic-sized pools. And just in case you were wondering what the price tag is on all of this, at least a million dollars, Avery, and that's just for phase one of this project. Mm, and it will be very interesting to get that up-close look a little bit later on today. Thanks, yeah. Paul.